Free form essential amino acid ingestion stimulates MPS more than an equivalent amount of intact protein. This, for example, stimulates more muscle growth than real food, for example, steak, eggs, chicken, beef, liver, you name it, more. Is that hard to understand? Breaking news on EAAs, many people have doubted this in the past, but this just out. And remember, this is from a very credible source. The Journal of the International Society of Sports Nutrition. Wait till you see what they say about essential amino acids. In the past, as you know, many bodybuilders have raved about the benefits of EAAs. Perhaps you've heard about BCAs, and many people felt this is garbage. They don't do anything. It's essentially useless. It's just flavored water. But bodybuilders, because of their experiments, they've known this for years, that EAAs can, in fact, make a huge difference. And I know that right now you're doubting me. You're thinking this is just an ad. It's not just an ad. I'm talking about actual science, that EAAs can make a big difference in your ability to build muscle. And those of you out there, perhaps the Jeff Nippards, the BioLanes, are thinking, yeah, well, show me a mechanism of action. Show me that it actually works. How does it work? Well, it shows it. Mechanism of action. The importance of muscle protein turnover. And so what essential amino acids do is they signal the body to begin to build muscle. Remember what I said? There's five opportunities for muscle protein synthesis to occur. Well, when you consume essential amino acids, it signals the body to now let's get on it. Let's start to build muscle. Let's repair the muscle. Let's get it rebuilt right now. And so this can add on to and make it better those five opportunities for muscle growth to occur. And not only that, the essential amino acids, they don't just signal the body to build muscle, they're actually involved in the process of building muscle. They are essentially the building blocks. Think of it, essential amino acids. They are essential for building muscle. And so if you add EAAs, it can and will help to promote muscle growth. And people are going to say, yeah, but if I'm already getting enough protein, I eat plenty of meats, chickens, and so on, that it's not going to work. Well, the paper actually he says this is not true. If you consume essential amino acids on top of your protein, that you're going to, in fact, build even more muscle. And so I'm going to go over the conclusions that this paper has made. Remember, conclusions. Repeated EAA-induced MPS stimulation throughout the day does not diminish the anabolic effect of meal intake. And so what that means is if you have essential amino acids throughout the day, perhaps you're drinking at the gym, it's not going to diminish the effects of having your protein throughout the day. The protein that you've already eaten, perhaps it was in those five meals, it does not decrease those effects. And so all it can do is add to it. And so this can allow you to build even more muscle than if you just simply consumed five meals throughout the day. Without exercise, remember, without exercise, without even doing anything, EAA supplementation can enhance functional outcomes in anabolic resistant populations. And so remember, these are anabolic resistant. Those are essentially what we term hard gainers. They have a hard time building muscle. And so think of it, you're not training in the gym, you have a hard time building muscle, you consume essential amino acids, and it helps you to build muscle. And so another thing to keep in mind is it's very safe. You're not going to damage your your kidneys. It's not dangerous. You're not going to overload on protein. And so if you add an EAs on top of perhaps you're having one gram of protein per pound of body weight anyway, it's not going to put you at any risk for any damage whatsoever. And so don't think that taking EAs somehow going to cause you bodily harm. And so an important question, how much do we need? How many grams of essential amino acids should you consume? And so this is great news. It's stating that even at only 1.5 to 3 grams at rest, it can stimulate greater muscle building potential. But it does, in fact, plateau after a certain amount, roughly 15 to 18 grams. And so if you were to consume somewhere between one and a half and 18 grams of EAS per day, you're going to be somewhere at your ideal. And so if you consume a scoop of Perilite, which I consume every single day, you're going to get seven grams of essential amino acids, more than enough to stimulate muscle protein synthesis. And if you consume two scoops, you'd be pretty much at the maximum benefit possible. And so if you want to get Perilite, 
right? Of course you can. Use code Greg, 10% off. Click the link in the description. The muscle protein stimulus stimulation by essential amino acids does not require non-essential amino acids. And so if you are, for example, only consume this, nothing else added onto it, it's enough to create muscle protein synthesis. And so only adding in essential amino acids, which is in this, you can get it from other things, of course, there are other companies that sell it. But if you just add that to what you're doing right now, it can be a benefit. Number six, and this is a big one. You might be thinking, real food. I only want real food. This is garbage. Supplements aren't as good. It's actually the opposite. Free form essential amino acid ingestion stimulates MPS more than an equivalent amount of intact protein. This, for example, stimulates more muscle growth than real food, for example, steak, eggs, chicken, beef, liver, you name it, more. Is that hard to understand? And this is on a gram per gram basis. And so if you consume seven grams of essential amino acids in one scoop of this, you're gonna get more muscle building than seven grams of protein from chicken or steak, tuna, etc. Get it? Do you really get it now? I hope you do. Seven from this, which is still not real food, is better than seven from real food. Get it? EAA requirements rise in the face of calorie deficits. And so if you're on a cut, if you're dying, if you're a Sam Sulek cutting, if you're a bodybuilder and you are eating fewer calories than last time, essential amino acids are even more important. And so when is the best time to take it? If you had to take it at one time, when you're on a diet, when you're on a cut, when you're trying to get shredded for summer, beach, and so on. And so please consider essential amino acids if you're on a cut. And why is this? Well, think about it. During a calorie deficit, it's essential to meet whole body essential amino acid requirements to preserve anabolic sensitivity in skeletal muscle. And so if you're cutting, protein is even more paramount. If you're on a bulk, remember the calories from carbs and fats have a protein sparing effect. The more carbs and fats that you consume, the less your body's gonna use proteins for energy. And so if you're bulking, protein requirements, they actually go down. Many people think, I'm on a bulk, I need to eat way more chicken steak and so on. It's not true, it's in fact the opposite. When you're on a cut, that is when you need the most protein. And so when are the best times to take essential amino acids? Well, for one, if you're one of those people that gets up and does fasted anything, you're one of those fasted type people, oh, I don't eat till lunch, I don't eat till supper, I don't eat for days on end. You should do it first thing in the morning. Whenever you're not consuming protein, it's even more important. And aside from that, sip it anytime you want all day long. You could have one and a half to three grams here, one and a half to three grams there. And so for example, you could put perilite in your jug of water, mix it in, drink it throughout the day. Drink it whenever you want. That's the beauty of it. There's no special time. You don't have to do it any given time. You can sip it all day long and reap its rewards. Hopefully you learned something. And remember, this is an educational video, but of course, at the same time, I want you to buy perilite. I'm giving you the science. I'm breaking it down. Hopefully you'll be interested in getting perilite. But remember, you you can get EAAs from any other company. I'm just trying to help. Subscribe, click the bell button, comment to boost the algorithm. Hopefully you liked the video. If you did like it, also watch one of those two loops. And don't forget, I have a harder than the last time clothing company. And of course, cookbooks, training books, circle diet book, all kinds of stuff going on. And a free diet and training program. If you go to my website and your first and last name and email address, coming straight to you. It's close to 50 pages. How can you go wrong? And until next time, I am out.